Hey, Learn Dash fans. So in this video, I want to show you how to, as an admin, how you can mark a, a lesson or a topic incomplete for one of your students. So by default, I don't think Learn Dash offers a way for students themselves to go back and mark something as incomplete. If they've already marked it as complete, that's it. They have to move on. There's no other option for them to change their mind. However, as a course admin, you do have the ability to go back and mark lessons and topics as incomplete for your students. So it may not work if you have a huge class with a really, really large enrollment and a ton of students, but for the smaller classes, this will work just fine for now. There probably is some custom code or a plugin out there. I'm not aware of anything yet, so if you know of something, please share it in the comments. That'd be great. But for now, for the admins, let me show you how to mark a lesson or topic as incomplete. So you'll log into your WordPress admin area, and you're gonna to wanna to go to your users screen. So this is under users and all users. From here, you're gonna to wanna to find the user that you want to edit their status. So you can either search for users up in the top right hand corner, you can search by username or email address or even their actual first and last name if you've collected that info when they signed up for your course. So once you find the student that you need to edit, Go ahead and click the edit link under their name. Now on this page we're going to scroll down until you see course info. So now under this course progress details right here, you'll see a list of all the courses that you currently have on your site. Find the one that contains the lesson that you need to mark and complete. And then come over here all the way onto the right and click on details. This will open up a list of all the lessons, topics, and quizzes that are associated with that course. Now you'll see some of these boxes are checked and some are unchecked. So essentially what this means, if the box is checked, that means that that lesson is marked complete, and if it's unchecked, it's incomplete. So you can use these arrows here to open up and look at the topics and quizzes that are below each lesson, and essentially just uncheck the boxes for the different things that you want to mark incomplete. And once you've unchecked those, Go ahead and scroll all the way to the bottom and make sure that you click update profile and that will save your changes. Then you could let your student know that that lesson or topic or quiz has been marked incomplete and they can go back, review it, and when they're ready again, mark it complete once again. I hope this was helpful. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.